Security. What going on YouTube? It's your boy Three back with another video, man. It's been a minute, but we ain't even gonna get into all that. We're gonna go ahead and get into what y'all see in the title, bro. It's a lot of I ain't gonna say it's a lot of background, but it's like a um it's a lot of key background information that's kind of like needed for this story so like that's what we're gonna start it but y'all see the title man obviously this is about the first time i got into a car accident um crazy part is this is the only car accident i've been in and i wasn't even driving that's really why i was kind of like low about the whole situation but like y'all let's see what what happened so basically around this time i got into the car accident i was in um i was in dawson mm -hmm. Don't matter if y'all know where that's at now. But at the time, I had been traveling back and forth to Dawson at this time, like, a lot because my dad's side of the family fled down there. And at the time, like, I wasn't really kicking it with nobody or being cool with people and shit like that up here besides, obviously, my couple partners and shit. But, like, at the time, when I first started traveling down there a lot, I had just, me and this girl that I was with for, like, three years had just broke up. So, like... Most of our time was spent together, so I was like, you know what, I don't want to be around this area, this and that, and then it was like, so I just would be going, doing shit, like, I'd be somewhere every other day just because I didn't want to send out, so, pretty much every weekend, I started going down there to, um, to Dawson, just to, like, stay with my cousins and stuff like that, and, mind you, this is our, I was already, mind you, I was already messing up because, me going, because of the schedule I had, at the time, I was just, I was pretty much a store manager at Dollar General, so, my manager being the lame that he is, I ask for Sundays off because I go to church like when I can. I'm not gonna sit here and just act like I'm just, you know, but I go to church when I can. So I was trying to get Sundays off. And bruh being the way he is, he gave me Saturdays off. I was oh, I should be happy. You young. Why wouldn't you want a Saturday? I'm like, bruh, you, you done missed the whole point, but whatever. So I'm off on Saturdays. So I, what I would do is I would work all Friday, get off Friday drive three hours down there to Albany, be there the whole, uh, be there that night, be there the whole Saturday because I was off, but the thing about when I was working there, Sundays was the earliest day that I had to be at the store because Sundays is they would do like QCs, outs, all the extra stuff, stuff like that, like for the store, like before we even open, like we got to be there like six, five o'clock in the morning before we even open to do all that stuff for the day being or whatever the case may be, so Mind you, like I said, Albany is a three-hour drive. So what I was doing pretty much every weekend because I got paid every weekend and I wasn't doing nothing else. I was dead. Go, like I said, I would work Friday, go down there Friday night, be there all Saturday, and then be there till three in the morning and leave at three in the morning exactly at three or two something to get right to work on time. Like I wouldn't even go home. I wouldn't do nothing. I would go straight from Dawson, my auntie house, or if I got a hotel or something, straight to work. Like and change clothes when I got there. So I had been doing that for a little time now, this and that for a couple months. And then throughout that time, I started talking to somebody down there. So it's like the trip just became more like regular. Like I was already going down there, so now I had more of a reason to go down there. So Driving back and forth, driving back and forth, driving back and forth. And if y'all know me, I ain't really like, um, me and my brother don't like, we, it's like, we cool, I don't know. But it's like, we ain't really, you feel me? So, cool like that or whatever. It's like, I don't know how, I'm not finna get into all that. But me and my brother not really cool like that. But at the time, I was like, you know what? Come down here with me, fool, like this and that. So I had not already made like a trip or two with him being with me. So, the second time around, I'm like, bruh. You might as well drive. Like you, you, you not coming out here. You not helping me pay for gas. You not helping me do nothing. You just ride along, and you don't gotta work or nothing. Like you might as well drive. You gonna come? So I think I had let him drive one time before, or maybe this was the first time. I want to say this was the first time, but I believe I brought up the idea of some drive beforehand. But whatever. But this particular time, like I said, I'm already down there. This now, I'm kicking it with the girl I was um, talking to at the time and stuff. I get up like to some to go get him to wake him up. He already on board. Like soon as I'm shaking him and shit, I'm like, oh. As soon as I'm shaking him and everything, like I can see what type of time he on. Like I can see like, oh, bro. Like he, I don't know what it was, but he was just being weird. Like he had like it one time, and he had been sleep, and he wasn't doing nothing. Like he just being weird. So I'm like, he already moving slow, slow. So he already pissed me off because like now it's like, literally. 
I don't know about y'all, but when it comes to me, when I get up, I can get up, get ready, or lead like this. So most of the time, I ain't gonna say I plan out quick time, but like when I get up, I know it's enough time for me to get up and get ready because I don't like being late for stuff or whatever the case may be. So I'm like, when I wake him up, it's like you gotta wake up at this time so we can get there on time. You feel me? All that. So he moves slow in this nap, blah, 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 but it's like the same time I'm trying not to rush. I'm like, it is three in the morning. And it's like I don't want you to mess up and we get in an accident. So, so he finally get up or whatever this night. We get in the car. We ain't even ride for 10 minutes. And I remember this because it was like so funny because at the time I was on the phone with a girl too. I was on the phone chilling. And I remember it, he was playing Sade. And mind you, Sade, I messed with you or whatever. But like, I was already irritated. And this man was just getting on my nerves. And it's like, bro, this is like, I don't know. He was just, it's like, I don't know. Nothing was clicking that day. So, he in the car playing shot A. I'm like, bro, turn this, turn this off, bro. Like, I'm not trying to hit this right now. Like, fool, I'm finna go to sleep. Like, you blast the shot. Like, I'm not trying to hit this. So, I remember going back and forth with them about that. Man, not even 10 minutes later, we riding or whatever the case may be. Bro, I look up. When I tell <laughs> What I tell you, bro, because, like, I don't know how it is with y'all, but I don't like riding with people. Like, that's why I drive everywhere. That's why I got my own car, because when the time to go, time to go. When I leave, I leave when I want to go. When I want, like, I don't like riding with nobody, even though this is my car. But he was driving. I don't like riding people. So, it's like, I'm sitting here just, like, on full, like, trying to go to sleep, just take a little nap. At the same time, it's like, uh. So, I look up. Mind you, we not even, like, 15 minutes into this ride. We ain't even got out of Dawson yet, got on the highway, none of that. I look up, bro, when I tell you the, like, one of the biggest deers from hell himself is running, but, like, you know how deers, like, to jump over hoods of cars or, like, whatever, like, it's coming at an angle, like, it ain't even, like, running right at us, in a sense, but it's, like, the angle it has is gonna hit us type thing, like, it's gonna hit us, like, we going like this, like, like, this the deer, and this us. But, like, the, the speeds that we going, we're meeting at the same place. You get what I'm saying? So, like, it's like, boom. So, the deer hit the side, like, the front side of the hood. And, and I'm going to put pictures in it. And mind you, I don't mind my hands, bro. I'm at work. Bro. So, like, they asked you, bro. I wash my hand 4,000 times. How these people always be nasty. But he hit the side of the car. But, like, the deer was so big that, like, Both sides of the car had damage. I'm just glad it ain't jumped because, like, if it would have jumped, it came through the windshield. Probably both of us would have would have passed away, like for real, for real, because it was big, like as hell, like, like it was to the point we ran it over, like, ran it over, got out the car, headlight missing. Now, like I said, y'all gonna see by the picture and everything. Headlight missing, hood crumbled up and everything, bro. When I tell you the deer was nowhere to be found, like he got up and kept going. And he got an extra headlight now. Like he took my headlight and kept kept moving. Like did nothing to that man. Like, but bro, I was just so mad because it was like it was one of them things. Like I wasn't driving, so I didn't want to be just quick to blame nobody because I kind of seen what happened because it was one of those days. Like it wasn't avoidable for real, for real. But it was one of them things. Like where it's like me and him already weren't. Nah. And then they just gave me more reason to be mad. And then little bruh came off like he was gonna help pay for the um for the deductible and everything. Bruh ain't help pay for nothing. Like my car was messed up for like six months, six, seven months because there's like just a bunch of insurance stuff I was going through at the time and everything. And then I ended up finally getting fit, but bruh ain't help with nothing. The whole situation was just irritating. And then like I said, that's my one and only car accident. I wasn't even driving and and it was in my car. So like I don't know. I ain't really know how to feel about it. I was really mad at the time being, but it was just crazy because I was like, well, it could have went a lot worse, like, for real, for real. Like, if y'all had seen the deer, I wish it would have died so I could show y'all. But if y'all had seen the deer, bro, the deer was big. Like, if it was, like I said, it was one of them. If it would have jumped and did what it regularly does, like, we probably both would have passed away from it. You feel me? So, hey, man, I'm just starting back up. This is a marathon, bro. We're going on 3 day. Oh, I don't even know if it's 3 day. Might be long. But I know it's at least three-day marathon. I'm posting, man. Back to back, back to back. I'm dropping, man. This video getting dropped today. So, y'all will see it in a couple of hours, man. Again, I've been appreciating y'all turning this channel up, man. Liking videos, viewing the channel, tapping in with Instagram, all that. Continue to do it. I'm still here, like I said. Um, 
Your boy just been enjoying life. You feel me, like? But, but yeah, man. Appreciate y'all again, bro. Continue to like and subscribe to the channel. Like this video, share it, show it to somebody. Until the next time, gang. We out, y'all boys. Be safe, man.